there's a bit of a problem. I gotta, I tore a hole in my Among Us costume, so I gotta, I, we have to learn how to, to sew to fix it um, because this is unacceptable. <laughs> this is like a little, this is kind of a mess. So to learn how to sew, I figured I'd get a pair of shorts because I, I, for Cat Warehouse, we want to make shorts. So if we can go to the thrift store right now to get some shorts that we cut apart that we learn how to make shorts. But I gotta, I gotta replace my license plate cover really quick because it's broken and that's not safe. I don't want to get pulled over. So that is it's completely snapped. All right, let's go to the thrift store. Yeah, I, I don't want to wear this. Can you unzip me? Okay, you you have to you have to you have to crawl through the window. This suit is a hazard. Yeah, that looks really cool actually. If we die because I'm wearing this trying to drive, I'm so sorry. Jesus. Holy mother of God, that's gonna be us in a second. You can't die wearing a mother. Hey, we can do it too. It's not that hard. <laughs> Does this helmet make me look like mentally ill? I don't think I have the courage to wear this inside Goodwill. So it turns out that the Chinese manufacturers are not only cheaper, but they're actually, they're better. <laughs> so we asked for the thickest pair of underwear they could make. And they made these, which is like kind of close, but they're more like shorts. So I figured that that probably means that we have to learn how shorts are made. This Goodwill kind of sucks. And that then we can learn how to sew, and then I can learn how to fix the Among Us costumes. Yeah, so that's the crotch of the shorts. That's where we got to put the most work into that. What we're doing right now is we're finding things we like, we're gonna cut them apart and we're gonna steal the design. Because why make something from scratch when you could uh, just copy someone else who's already done a good job? Is that legal? It's great. You actually want that? Where all the clothes come from? They bring them, like let's say it'll be people like, you can donate anything basically. Anything? Yeah, you can donate anything. Like a car? Anything. No, 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 okay, yeah, actually you can. What, I have a car with, I have a car that a tree fell on, would they take that? Or do I have to take no, the tree off first? I don't think that's how you take that. Okay. Man, we didn't get yelled at all. Also our shirt printer, they, they printed the I'm in debt shirt on the wrong blank, so if you want to buy one of these shirts, they're on sale for, are we doing this again? All right, let's see our bounty. We've got a pair of, we got a lot of soft shorts. I think we're just sort of going for soft shorts. We've got a pair of regular, <laughs> those are not regular shorts. So the joke for Valentine's Day was to make long underwear. And they came back with basically shorts. The only issue is when you, when you put them on, I feel like I have to demonstrate this. There's really no other way to test this stuff, so. It's like, they're, they're, they're fun, but <laughs> It just sort of like has, it almost looks like I pooped my pants. It, just, it looks like I'm wearing, it kind of looks like I'm wearing a diaper. This is supposed to be like a good promotion for cat wearers. I have a feeling nothing about this makes us look like we have any idea what we're doing. How many hours did you spend on this? I'm just destroying it. It's fine. I feel bad. You know, I'd feel, I'd feel worse if the seam work was better. <laughs> okay, I'm seeing some, I'm seeing some similarities. So, uh, I'm not sure we have quite enough material. I mean, they look, We'll see what happens. I'm not always right. I know that I say, I always, I know what I'd have. I'm just cutting at this point, like, there's no going back. Which one do I press? You got the foot pedal? All right, <laughs> holy God, oh my God. Whoa, oh, okay, there's like six buttons and I'm still confused. This is what, this is what it's like flying an airplane. What is this? How does this, what, is, I don't really, I actually really don't understand what any of these mean. I feel like I'm supposed to use one of these, no? And then the next, the next shot is me with a pair, a half pair of shorts stuck to my hand. <laughs> so there's an, there's an air, E1. Literally, I clicked the pedal and it freaked out. What if we just do it? Oh, well, you haven't pushed it down yet. Okay, it's not going forwards at all. You have to pull it through. Oh, I'm never gonna be able to pull this through. How do I cut it? Where's the cutter? You're not pulling it through. So I can't pull it through. Why does it not work? Um, but how am I supposed to? Ah! Oh my God. Hey, William. Hey, mom. I'm trying to use this sewing machine, but it's not working, and then it made me bleed. I'm on my way over that way anyway, because I guess Dad is out there, so I'll go by your house first. Okay. See ya. Take a look. Okay. Bye, mom. Bye. New band-aids on Cat Warehouse. They're only $8, which I think is actually probably a little bit expensive for bandages, but it's because they're, is it normal price? It's normal price. It's the normal price. Are, you, are we lying to them? No, they're 20 band-aids. How much do they cost on Amazon? Oh, Amazon's shitty. Well, how much do they cost on Amazon? 
on Amazon you can get a hundred band-aids for eight dollars. Okay, so what do they look like? it doesn't matter, they're cheaper. So if I was you, if you're looking for band-aids, go to Amazon and buy actual name brand band-aids. They're they don't have any art on them, and they're eight dollars and they're you get a hundred and they're better. Is very fair. Yeah, but $8 for 100 bandage is arguably better. How how can how can, how can how can we how can we reduce how can we add five times the number of band-aids to every pack? Was it something I said? I didn't say they were bad, I just said that you could get more for the same money on Amazon. Look, you get for three dollars and thirty cents you can get thirty band-aids. Whose side were you on? I just, I'm on the customer's side. My, my mom said this fabric is hard to sew on. That makes me feel a little bit better. Does it make you feel, make you feel better? Did I do a good job? Oh, uh, I mean, it depends on what it's supposed to be. I don't know. Uh, okay, so I think she didn't see how bad it was earlier. Oh my gosh. What? Is that what you're wearing? <laughs> this is, can what we, I think we just need to throw this video in the trash. Did you cut it like this? I think, I feel like we're getting roasted right now and she doesn't even realize it. I'm gonna do, I can, I've got it. What's, I'm gonna stab you. You what? Like that? You have to, oh, you're gonna stab me in the eye, mom. No, I will not. We only have to, how many of these do we have to make, Hannah? By hand, we have to make 100 of these. What? We have to make 4,000, no, I'm just kidding. Are you, you know, and the better machine for this would be a double overlock. <laughs> Hannah, did you hear that? You should have got a double overlock machine. <laughs> Let's go! Full speed, baby. Oh, that is full speed. What am I doing wrong? I'm I'm trying to pull it straight. What? They're all they're un the whole thing is unraveling. Well, but Hannah did that. But I didn't do that one. Huh? Hannah did that. You know what? These don't these don't feel half bad. They look like they fit better. They no, they they definitely fit better. It feels much that feels much more natural than the other one. Oh shit! I picked the shortest ones. All right, so. <laughs> <laughs> You. Yeah, Cat Warehouse, kind of a fashion, a fashion statement. This is it, this is the culmination, this is the, the grand finale of Did I Learn Anything? I am fixing my Among Us costume. Oh my god, actually this is really easy. Wait, did I just fix my oh, inflatable Among Us costume? No way, oh my god. So, I think that there's a lot of people who are uh, afraid to achieve their ambitions because of what they think other people think. <laughs> if there's anything I've learned, it's that you just, you just gotta do something even if you think people are gonna think you're stupid for it. You know, sewing, I feel like when I was in middle school, somebody would make something, made, they totally would have made fun of me for sewing. Did, did that stop me from achieving my dreams? No, I don't, I don't think so, look at me. Look at me now. This is a kid who wasn't afraid to, well he was afraid, but I don't, you know, you know what I'm saying.